हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू दिस चैनल आज हम क्वेश्चंस लेंगे जो सबसे पहला पार्ट होता है एंड दैट इज इंट्रोडक्टरी क्वेश्चंस इन आयल्स स्पीकिंग इंट्रोडक्टरी क्वेश्चन जो होते हैं वो अराउंड सिक्स टू एट होते हैं लेट्स सी आज क्लास में जो स्टूडेंट्स बैठे हैं ये क्या क्वेश्चन पूछना चाहते हैं अक्सर ये बात करते हैं सर लेटेस्ट पीडीएफ आई है क्या पीडीएफ आई है जो लाने क्वेश्चन लाइए मोस्ट वेलकम आई इन्वाइट द स्टूडेंट्स कम ऑन माई लेफ्ट एंड राइट कम प्लीज कम स्टैंड हियर स्टार्ट क्वेश्चनिंग मी गुड गुड एनीबडी एल्स गुड कम सो कम 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 ये गुड सो स्टार्ट फ्रॉम दिस साइड या योर क्वेश्चन प्लीज सर माई क्वेश्चन पब्लिक गार्डन एंड पार्क पब्लिक गार्डन एंड पार्क ओके Okay, my first question is: Would you like to play in a public garden or park? Well, I would say that uh, since I love flowers and also I respect the people who are moving or walking or children who are playing, so I would not like to play there. Rather, I would like to go to the playground and play because we have to respect flowers and the public property. The next question is. What do you like to do when visiting a park? Well, first thing that I usually do that is to walk. Say hello to everybody I meet. So it's a kind of a social interaction as well. And the third thing is I'll ensure that there is no garbage lying there. So I'll remove the litter. I'll remove uh, the bits of paper and other things and put them to the dustbin. How have parks changed today compared to the time when you were a kid? Oh uh, well, when I was a kid, uh, parks usually uh, they were in very bad shape. But now the government has spent a lot of money. It's not only about parks now. It's not only to uh, do jogging or to walk. Rather, we have open air gyms as well. So you find more and more people coming forward, and uh, they usually do different exercises, particularly. women and children even elderly people they can be noticed doing it so my last question is yes would you prefer to play in a personal garden or public garden well honestly speaking public garden means our responsibility to maintain it so there's no point playing for example you start playing uh, football or basketball i think it is absolutely wrong on our part at the same time it is uh, if it is a uh, uh, private park and i know the person with the permission of that man i would like to play it can be badminton or some sort which doesn't affect the plantation there i hope you are satisfied yes sir. okay anybody else yes, yeah i have a question on mirror on mirror is wow aina aina jhoot nahi bolta kehta na dar par jhoot nahi bolta yeah how often do you look at yourself in the mirror every day oh इनका सवाल है कि आप दिन में कितनी बार देखते हैं असलियत नहीं बताना कि सुबह उठते साथ जो है वो देखते हैं उसके बाद दिन में पांच बार देखते हैं फिर मिरर नहीं होता तो मोबाइल में देखते हैं <laughs> इतने ज्यादा कॉन्शियस होने की जरूरत नहीं कुछ लोग कपड़े बदलते हैं बार 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 बदलते हैं डैंडीज उनको डैंडीज बोलते हैं कुछ लोग लुक्स के बारे में बहुत ज्यादा ऑब्सेस्ड होते हैं कुछ नहीं है तुम बहुत बढ़िया हो कॉन्फिडेंस हाई होना चाहिए बाल कम हो तो तब भी चलता है नोरीज राइट ओके So in the question is how often do you look into the mirror the answer is well once in the morning when i get ready i look into the mirror and also i look into my eyes main apni aankhon mein bhi jhaankta hu while looking into the mirror and make a, a kind of a promise that i'm going to make it a beautiful day mirror mein nahi dekhta main apne aap mein bhi dekhta hu mirror ke andar bhi ek mirror hai right aur main vaada karta hu ki aaj ka din main zabardast banane wala hu and before i sleep i look into the mirror and i pat myself saying that yes i did it hmm yes. and okay yes. second question is have you ever thought oh, have you ever bought mirrors well um to decorate my room i purchase small mirrors one second twice i had to buy uh, a rear view mirror for my scooty स्कूटी में भी तो मिरर लगा होता है और जो आप घर में डेकोरेशन करते हैं छोटे छोटे शीशे होते हैं मिरर लगते कि नहीं लगते हैं सो आपकी प्रेजेंस ऑफ माइंड बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है कितने अवेयर हैं आप एंड थर्ड 
I, uh, by a looking mirror, I think uh, once in three to four years. But, a mirror ke upar hi aapko kitni jaankari hai. Sir, wo mirror nahi isme subah subah aap dekhte hain, din mein dekhte hain, baar 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 dekhe hain, dekhe hain, dekhe hain, dekhe hain. Uske lava bhi mirror hai. Usse usko interview ko acha lagega ki student aware. Yeah. Would you use mirrors to decorate home? Na aage na wohi question. Ab humne repetition se bachna hai. Well, whenever it is Diwali or Christmas, I usually buy around 50 pieces of mirrors and I use waste material, waste pieces of cloth or bits of cloth or rags, waste paper and I decorate my room, I would say using different paints and fixing mirrors. Now what you have seen in this answer is that you are aware that you are making best out of the waste. Is it clear? Yeah. Next question. Do you check yourself when you decide to buy a mirror? Well, I'm not really very particular about buying mirrors. Because once you buy a mirror, it remains on your wall for three years, four years. You don't really need those mirrors. And I'm happy with it. And even I'm happy without a mirror. So I can do without a mirror, I, I, I would say. Because the inner mirror, the real mirror is my inner mirror, that's my heart, that's a, a beautiful one. It reflects what I think, than what I see myself or try to find into the mirror. Mirror dil jo hai, wo ahi ne jaisa hai. Wo mujhe bata dhata hai ki okay hai sab kuch, don't worry. Or agar aap shishe mein dek dek ke baar baar ye thik nahi hai, ye thik nahi hai, ye thik nahi hai, ye shirt match nahi kar rahi. You're wasting time unnecessarily. So, it's a very formal situation. You're watching the sheet and you're watching the sheet. That's good enough. But if you're so conscious, your confidence level will be reduced. Somewhere you'll have to accept that it's okay. But yeah, I'm the best. Yeah. That's all? So, I want to ask you some questions regarding space travel. My first question is, do you want to travel in outer space? Well, honestly speaking, I'm not at all interested, ma'am. It is for the reason that, we are living on this earth. It's a beautiful planet. Rather, it was more beautiful about 50 to 100 years ago. I want that I do a lot of research and I do something for the earth here and now in, instead of investing money and time finding some other planet or moving to the space. What for? I'll be polluting the environment. So what is required is we focus on the earth. We must live in present. Future will be beautiful. Let's concentrate on our earth. Isko sundar banana zoriye hai. Parayvar ko bachana zoriye hai. Yahan ki problems ko address karna hai zoriye hai. Instead of going to the space. I'm sorry, I would not go there, ma'am. My second question is, what would you do if you had the opportunity? If I had the opportunity, even then I will try not to go. Even then, if NASA says that Mr. Banerjee, you are the best person who can be an astronaut after Kalpana Chawla, then I'll really go. Let America invest. I'll know I'll save my country's money. Then I'll try to find out whether it is uh, uh, fine to move to that place. Some scientists say that there would be collision of uh, the earth with some other heavenly body or some asteroid or satellite. So I'll really find out if we can find houses, if we can make houses out there, if we can find water there, if life would be possible. I'll try to find out. But my primary concern is the earth, making lives better on the earth. Do you think it's necessary to see other planets also? Ma'am, it is good to explore more. Let the scientists do it, but as far as I'm concerned, I love the Earth. I want to ensure that population is checked, uh, degradation of the environment is checked. Of course, yes, after once we, after or once we take care of the Earth, we explore more planets. Let's do it. I won't mind that. Ma'am. My last question is: yes, Do you like to travel by air? Most of the times, I like to travel by. Uh, public transport, but in case it is emergency or I fall short of time uh, or I have to go abroad, obviously there is no other option that to go by plane because I 
uh, feel that somewhere planes are also polluting the environment. If we can reduce carbon emission to some extent, we are doing a great service to the country, to the world. Anybody else? Well, sir, my yeah. question on sky. My first question is, do you like to see the sky? Well, ma'am, sky, in fact, inspires me. To be a part of the sky means the stars, the sun. I would like to shine like the sun, the stars, one day. So I love the sky, the openness, the infinite sky, the beautiful sky that inspires me, ma'am. How about stars? Well, ma'am, when it is uh, a starlit night, it looks like a bride, and we are a part of the entire system where you find uh, the twinkling of stars reminding you of your childhood, and also it inspires you to touch the sky someday, be a star someday. Right? Which is a good place to see the stars? Uh, I think my house, the rooftop of my house is the best one because uh, there is no obstruction at all. The sky is usually clear, there is no pollution. So that's the best place, ma'am. Do you know something about stars? In fact, ma'am, when I was uh, a student of 6th standard, I had read about uh, stars, comets, meteors, meteorites, or shooting stars, and so on and so forth. Yes, I still remember, ma'am. Thanks to my geography teacher, Mrs. Malhotra who taught me, taught me these things so effectively that they are in my heart even today, ma'am. How often do you look at the sky? In the morning, I look at the sun, I bow my head because I thank the sun for bringing brightness and crushing darkness. And at night, I thank the moon for giving us relief from the sun and making uh, night a beautiful and a relaxing experience, ma'am. Do you prefer the sky in the morning or the sky at night? Both are equally important, both are equally beautiful, ma'am. Actually, the rising sun and the dipping sun or the stars at night actually remind you that you are on this earth for some years, not forever. So they remind you that you have to shine, you have to sink. So both have equal significance. Can you see the moon and the stars at night where you live? Where, I, where you live? Yes. Yeah, ma'am. Uh, in fact, uh, almost every second or third day, I go to the rooftop, look at the stars, smile, and be a part of the, the universe. It is really relaxing when you are part of a big thing. Is there a good place to look at the sky where you live? Up there were repetition on the rooftop. Well, ma'am, no doubt uh, my balcony of also offers uh, a good view, but I would say uh, the second floor, that is the rooftop, that is the best place. There is no noise of engines, nothing of sort. So I really enjoy being there for some time. I really like uh, stargazing at times. Do you want to live on other planets? I'm sorry, I want to live on the earth. My people are here. My brothers and sisters are here. I want to do something for the society. I want to make the lives of uh, people better. So I have no keenness to go to any other planet, ma'am. I'll be missing everybody. Thank you, sir. Anyways, friends, you have seen how many people have asked them to ask them. The presence of mind is very important. I'm sure you will like these answers. Right? Thank you very much. Subscribe, like, share, comment. Thank you very much.